Hey guys, it's Captain Collector. Welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be opening up a bunch of Funko Pop boxes. Um, I actually did buy the SDCC Nightcrawler. That was a Hot Topic exclusive. I just, I didn't want to like go to the store and, and try to hunt down for it during coronavirus. So like, um, I waited for prices to go down a little bit on eBay and I finally just ended up buying one for about maybe 35 total. Um, I opened it uh, right away and just to see because like if there's a problem, I just wanted to contact the seller right away. So I opened it. It was fine. I put it in a pop protector and now it's like in storage somewhere and I can't find it. So <laughs> I do have it. Um, that's what I picked up recently. And then also super recently, I picked up the, this is the Funko Hollywood exclusive of Megan Rapino. Originally, this was a Barnes & Noble exclusive and um but somehow barnes and noble like backed out of it or something and so instead of being like a funko shop exclusive they just they gave it to only funko shop hollywood and so i live just close enough where i actually was like you know what i'll go and try to get this in person um but honestly it was like an hour drive you know each way and during coronavirus, I was like, oh my God, this is not worth it. It's not worth risking your life over, but I just, I just did it. And so it's here now. I'm not going out again. Um, but this was the, this is her in like, I think they're away jersey at the red one. And then um, maybe they kind of wore this maybe in the trials or something because she has blonde hair in this one instead of pink. So. I forget at what point that she she dyed her hair but this one has blonde hair as opposed to the pink and the red jersey as opposed to the white so that goes with my collection over here okay so yes i have a bunch of uncles to open up today i think among these boxes i have i have like we're gonna try to hunt down for the chase of vision 50s vision from wandavision and also um inspector gadget I think his helicopter, no, not the helicopter, like the plane one where he's holding up a badge. There's a chase version where out of his hat comes like a, an extra mechanical arm. And so I usually don't hunt down for chases because I'm just like, um, it's just kind of like, it's just like a waste. Like you're just, you're probably not going to get it. Like the odds of getting it are pretty slim. And yeah, I tend to like not get the chases when I'm looking for them and I'll get the chases when I'm not looking for them. So but here I was like, you know what, I'll just try, um, you know, and if I don't get it, I'll just sell the extra or something. Like, I'll just try once. Like, I got two of each. Maybe I got it this time and I don't want to pay like 30 bucks for like someone else's on eBay to go get it. Um, so it's among this pile somewhere. I believe the ones for Entertainment Earth um, offer the chases. Also Hot Topic and Box Lunch do as well. But there's some stores where they like they don't give you the chase, like it's guaranteed. I think I think GameStop does it too, but but I just happened to order these from Entertainment Earth. Maybe I kind of combined on shipping or something, but anyway. So we'll, we'll try to get through those. Um, I don't know which one is which though. So do you wanna try opening up one of them first and seeing if we got the chase or not? Okay, let's try, let's try this one. Okay, so I don't know if this is the box for Vision or the box for Inspector Gadget, but we'll see. So basically what you do is like you just buy two of the pops, or I just bought two, but you just buy the pop and then they don't tell you if it's gonna be the chase and you can't specify if it's the chase. So so here we go. Let me, let me move this see it. Okay, so here is the first box. I'm not sure which one this is, or if you can tell if it's a chase or not. Okay, it's Inspector Gadget. And who knows, let's see. Oh, wow, the box is a dent in it, but we'll see. It is not the chase. This box is in terrible condition. I'm kind of, um. I don't know. I mean, they don't ship their pops like in protection and stuff, but I'm a little disappointed. Like the windows got kind of like scuffs on it. Um, structurally, the box looks good, but there is like 
a noticeable crease in the back. I guess it's not too bad, but that um, the scuffs on the front window are a little distracting. So that's Inspector Gadget. He look, he's actually a lot taller in person than I thought he'd be. He's got like a really noticeable chin, a long face, and a magnifying glass. And so we're looking for the chase where something will come out of his hat. Okay, here's our second. Okay, honestly, I hate like wasting money, like spending money on something and it's like not certain you'll get it. Like a lottery system, it's like, but this time I just like tried it. I don't know why. I guess I just don't want to like try to hunt one down in person or something, but let's see if the second one is the chase or not. Which side's the front? Oh, it is not. It is not the chase. Like sometimes um, I'll just order one pop and they'll give me the chase and I'm like, I didn't want the chase. Um, but this one, so I, I ordered two and both of them are the regular version. It looks like this one might be in a better condition. There's a little bit of a weird corner up here, but um, at least when you're looking at it from the window, it looks very good. So I think I'll probably end up keeping this one and then selling the other one. Man, that's too bad. I think the chase is going for like 30 bucks or something. We'll have to see. I actually just ordered the, I didn't realize, but Funko Shop has their own exclusive um, for Inspector Gadget and he's on roller skates. And so that was really cool. And I was surprised to see that was like not going for that much on eBay. So I actually picked one up for like 15 bucks, which is honestly MSRP. So I think the seller uh, kind of, kind of got the bad end of the deal, but that's coming later. And so even if I don't get the chase for this, having the one on skates is pretty cool. Okay, so we'll open up the other box, which is the 50s Vision, and see if I got, see if I got the chase on that. But in the meantime, we will order, um, open up some other ones. Um, this one just came in today from GameStop. I think there's only two pops in here, and it's a huge box, which is really sad always. But Okay, GameStop. So they gave me a huge box and they did give me a ton of extra brown paper. Wow, the pops are not in protectors, but at least there's a lot of packaging. And so I got two pops in this one. The first we have is Michael Burnham. So this is from Star Trek Discovery. I wasn't sure if I was gonna get this. Like, I haven't seen the show yet. I've kind of heard good and bad about it. I tried watching a trailer, and then one of the comments I did kind of agree with. I'm like, this is kind of like a not-so-great, like, Marvel movie. Like, the pacing of the dialogue was kind of strange to me. Um, but maybe if I saw it in person in real time, maybe it would seem better. But So this is her. I don't know uh, which kind of, at what point this is, like, how she looks. Because she has a couple different hairstyles in the show. She's like long hair. This is like her, a short hair with like a an updo at top. And then she's in the typical blue uniform that they have on Discovery and then a phaser. Um, so right now they're on season three. I haven't seen any shows yet, any episodes yet, but I do plan to give it a try and see if I like it. So the pop surprisingly is in pretty good condition. Um, I was a little surprised. I ordered four pops in this order and they shipped two in one order, in this order, and then two in a second order. And I was kind of thinking like, oh my God, did they like send me to from a store? <laughs> and like, what kind of condition will I come in? But surprisingly, it's in pretty good condition. Okay, and then the second pop we have in here, um, this is actually, ooh, in not so great condition, but this is a newer pop. Um, this is Nomi from 007, the new movie that has not come out yet, I think. Um, but I, I'm not really a 007 fan, but the reason I got this pop was because the actor, Lashana Lynch, um, she plays Maria Rambeau in Captain Marvel. So I just really like her, and I just, I, when I saw that they made a pop of her, I was like, oh my gosh, you know, let me just get this one too. And it's just so cool to see, to see her, like, be such a big character, you know, uh, a character in 007, so... I just got this to kind of support her, but 
the box doesn't look to be in that great of condition. I do feel like these came like from a store floor, like, yeah. But um, she's just kind of like in a black, I don't know, like a black uniform, kind of a military kind of thing. And then she's holding a gun. But yeah, that's Nomi from 007. Um, I don't really plan to watch it. I'm not really into like action movies at all. Okay, so we're gonna open up one more package before the vision, the, the hunt for vision. These two are from Box Lunch. Oh, cool. I think I know what this is, but I, I don't remember who, what series it is, but not exactly who they are. Okay. This was from like a pre-order from a long time ago and they finally came in stock. All right, let's see who we got. Oh, they're in um, boxes. We have one box here and one sorter here. And they're, oh. This is almost expiring. I'm not even gonna show you guys this promo code, but it's like 25% off, but it's totally gonna expire like within a couple of days. So that's what you get for not opening boxes right away. All right, so these ones are kind of labeled. I'm not gonna look at them. Let's see what they are. What is it? Oh, it's in a, oh my God, it's in tissue paper. Wow, that's new. Wow, that's really interesting. I've never seen tissue paper on top of a pop in a sorter. That's really nice. And wow, that's kind of sad. I honestly, I was getting this pop, Maria Sharapova, uh, to make a custom. And so, man, it came such a nice box. And I'm like, oh, I was going to take it out of the box and like actually like, you know, destroy it a little bit. But this is from um, real uh, tennis players that are super famous and super good. Um, I am not gonna collect the whole set. I have a couple, I think I have like four of these on pre-order, but this was actually for a custom that I have in mind. So we'll see, but this is um, her, Maria Sharapova in like a white, a white tank top skirt and tennis shoes and a hat. And she's holding, I think a, a head racket, a blue head racket in the back. Is it head? Yes, it's not bad a lot. And it's just so cool. I love the box and like the color schemes. Oh my gosh, look at this side. It's like the tennis court. And then there's like a blue for the um, the part where it's like out of bounds. And then the front, it's just got, um, the color scheme is just crazy. It's like tennis ball yellow. It's just so cool. Gosh, I don't know. Should I keep this one and get a second one that's like more destroyed to destroy that one further? I don't know. Okay. Here's another one, I believe is also a tennis pop. So we'll see who I got. Okay. Is it also in tissue paper? Oh my God, it is. Who is it? Can you even see through the tissue paper? Yes, yes, it's Venus Williams. She's so cool. Wow, she's in this like yellow tank top with black skirt and white tennis shoes. She also has like a hat and I don't know if like if this is like her own branding for Williams. Um, she's holding a Wilson tennis racket and a ball. That's so cool. Oh my God, the ball looks so cool. It's not like, you, there's no fuzz, but it's like super detailed. That's so cool. So I also have um, Nadal and Federer on pre-order. I think they're coming in soon, I forget. But the other ones, I don't really know. Like, I know this guy, he's like probably a very classic tennis player, but uh, the other ones I'm not super familiar with. Wow, the ball is like so detailed. And so she's actually number one, which she should be. The best tennis player, right? Venus Williams. Okay, so I think that's all of the like other pops. And so we're just gonna go ahead and open the Hunt for Vision. 
I just saw episode one of WandaVision today and um, honestly, after seeing the trailer a bunch of times and trying to like figure out which pops I wanted, I was expecting to see everything in the trailer in the first episode and it obviously didn't happen, right? Because it just wouldn't make sense to like have that much progress in one episode. So I have to like lower my expectations of when they're going to reveal what exactly happened to Wanda and wait. So I end up getting the 50s, the 50s um, WandaVision. I just ordered the 70s because I, I read that there were going to be like more characters that were well known and probably more pops too. And they look like they're in the 70s. So I was like, okay, I think I'll get the 70s line. But then for the, um, the Halloween, I'm like, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Based on the trailers, I'm like, hmm, I don't know. Because I don't really know Wanda and Vision from the comics as much. I know them from the MCU, so. Okay, here we go. This is the hunt for 50s Vision. That is the chase. Let's see. I don't know. What does the chase look like? The chase has his... His, his robot head or his regular head? I don't remember. Here's the first one. Okay. So the, um, let's get this box out of the way. So this is the regular version. He is in his work outfit. Um, he's got his, I just saw the episode. So they kind of like, Wanda kind of like magic his face to look more human, more normal. Instead of his normal vision. And so he's wearing these like super cute glasses. They're so giant but super cute and he's got a suit on and he's got his briefcase and it's just super cute and so we're hoping that the next one is the chase which i think he has like his normal robotic head um i don't know if he's wearing a hat as well in that one probably not but this box is in pretty good condition and so we'll see what we get in the next one Come on, Chase. I never get chases when I want them. Okay, okay. Oh, it's the normal one. See, it's like, don't bother. Don't bother getting, don't bother paying for more than one because you're. they're not going to give you the chase when you want it, you know. They can like tell. They're like, this person ordered two. We're not going to give it to them. But here's another one. Um, I don't know which one I'll keep. They're both in pretty good condition. But yeah, we'll have to see. They, they actually released two episodes um, first, and so I only seen I've only seen the first one, and I'll have to see what happens and if I'm going to collect like the Halloween ones and any future Wandavision pops. Okay, so that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys like the pops that came in today. Um, let me know in the comment section below like if you have any of these pops or if you're watching the new Disney Plus series. If you like this video, go ahead and click the like button. And if you want to be notified about future unboxings, feel free to subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next video.